So to evaluate this function, what we're going to do is it says to find f of negative 2. So what we're going to do, we're going to substitute in negative 2 for x. So I replace I see an x in my equation, I get to replace it with negative 2. Okay, so this is going to be 4 minus the cube root, and then I get a follow order of operations. I'm going to treat radicals like it's an exponent. So negative 2 uh, minus subtract 2 more is negative 4. And then what can we do here? Well, we know that 4, now if we take the cube root of a negative number, that's still negative, right? Because the, the, the cube root of negative 1 is negative 1, because negative 1 times negative 1 times negative 1 is still negative 1, right? So I, what I can do with this to make it a little easier is I know I can bring that negative outside, and that gives me subtract from there, plus the negative I just pulled out, the cube root of 4. And if I get double negatives, minus minus, I can change that to plus. And since 4 isn't a perfect cube, I really can't do a lot more with that. I mean, I could make it a decimal, grab a calculator and take the cube root of 4 and add it to 4, but uh, that's perfectly acceptable. Okay, so that's what that's what we do. And you can do this same thing on every on every single one of these problems. Okay, I hope that helps.